Yep, second game against uh, Lockdown. Unfortunately, we, uh, we started off slow again. I think we went down three or four points to nothing, and then uh, we got our crap together, came out, did some work. We kind of came in as the underdog. But, like, we, haven't, we, aren't, we weren't really prepared for this match. Um, we didn't even practice the layout. Uh, some of us, the first time even seeing the layout was walking on the field today to play Kobaklonk. Um, because of that, uh, we suffered greatly. Like, um, and also, like the first couple points with their penalties and stuff, I kind of thought. Like, I guess we kind of thought like that it was going to be an easy match kind of thing. Like they're getting penalties, they're going to play stupid. If we kind of just shoot them a couple extra times, maybe they'll get frustrated. And, but it obviously didn't work out. Like we were tied at half, and then it kind of just went downhill from there. Like they, I guess they were more prepared and they wanted it more. Well, for starters, we wanted to, we wanted to beat them. A lot of our guys played played on their team last year. We all know each other. We always practice. And second of all, we wanted to get in there and not have a slow start like we did against Wasaga. But as I said, it didn't work out. Dude, we did take a rage line from last year kind of thing. Um, but it was pretty much just because they were making room for a synergy, like synergy line anyway, I guess. Um, as for like, there was like no real bad blood or anything like that. Like everyone saw at the end of the match, there was a little uh, a little minor hissy fit going on. But it, it's paintball. Like everyone's friends right after the game's done anyway. Uh, spirits are high after today for sure. We pretty much guaranteed ourselves a spot in Nax, and I think uh, we might be either first or second now, depending on plus minus, since there's three teams that's all, all have had a loss. I think, I think every team's gonna be tough. We're just looking at it, you know, going in there, finally, hopefully, taking home the first place. We want it. We've been there so many times, and we know it's gonna be tough. So, we're gonna have to start practicing our asses off. No more slacking. I don't know. We got kind of. We guys got kind of cocky. Like everything we were doing. Nothing was working. They were, they were chomping us out of our bunkers. They, they were kind of sitting in the back rows and we were just running into their guns. Like we thought like maybe maybe if we kind of do the same thing, but they're, uh, they're an MPPL D1 winning team, right? That's kind of what they do. They can sit back and they can kind of make us play their game. That's pretty much what they did and it kind of screwed us over a bit. Um, we got to be more prepared. We got to practice. Um, unfortunately, a couple of our players today kind of gave up. They just kind of sat there and pouted. Um, they had illnesses of some sort, but maybe they maybe they didn't. They just didn't want to go out there and get get blasted. Uh, we were getting overshot a little bit, kind of thing. And I guess people were just like, "I've had enough. I've had enough." And they kind of thought, "We're not going to win." And yeah, we we need to work on that big time. Like even like it was like our like our better players on the team too, just giving up, complaining about, "Oh, we need better players," or "We need to fix this," and then just going out there saying, "Okay, you do this and you do this and you do this," on the field, like make like changing the plans and stuff. And it's it just it's so stupid. Like you can't do that kind of stuff. Like you actually have to be prepared, which we weren't. Um, good game, guys. Uh, I still I still love some of you. Some of you, uh, but uh, <laughs> that's it's paintball still. You guys, some of you are cool. But I had fun. Um, great game. It was exactly what I expected. <laughs>